we picked up a really cool clip where uh, Dr. Alan Lim uh, was talking about Zio at a cycling conference. Uh, Dr. Lim has, has been uh, using Zio, I guess, with the, with the team and finding that there's some really cool correlations between sleep and recovery. So I wanted to do a little video reply and talk about some of the things we've learned about sleep and sports um, and also reply. Uh, Alan talked a lot about some of the new technologies that would start integrating. We've got some cool stuff there as well. So the first thing that uh, we'll, I'll mention is that Sherry Ma out of Stanford has done some really neat research on sleep and sports. And what she's done is she's actually extended sleep for collegiate athletes, so 10 hours of sleep a night, which is way more than they normally get. And she found in, in one experiment with tennis players that their sprint times decreased 19% and their hitting accuracy went up 23%, which is obviously a huge increase. So sleep is key for these real performance athletes. Uh, Dr. Lim, you also, you also mentioned uh, in your talk the idea that you know, the bike power meter, which is used to see how much power you put into a bike, that used to be really difficult to use, and it was all this technical terminology, and that's gotten so easy to use over time that it's just part of the sport. Uh, we think that other sort of biometrics like sleep and activity and nutrition are all going to be that well integrated in the future. And the, the way that we think that's going to happen, we've, we've done some really cool work on the iPhone so far. This is a, a Zio app uh, that we built to look at and, and view your Zio sleep data on the web. I'm going to do a bit of future prediction. I think that you'll see uh, in a few years, you'll be able the ability to pull in data from Zio, to pull in data from the cycle, uh, from the bike power meter. You'll pull in data from weight scales, from you know, nutrition experts. All this data will come to one place and both the coach and the, the athletes will be able to look at their iPhone and say exactly how they're doing on a sort of day-to-day, minute-to-minute basis. Uh, and we're actually, we've opened up our API on the web to allow everyone to interface with Zio and make that really easy. So uh, keep up the good work uh, tying in sleep and sports and we look forward to, to more great stuff. Uh, the last thing I'll mention, Alan, is that I've, uh, I've got a new bike myself. Uh, now that Lance uh, is retiring, you know, I've been thinking about doing some training uh, for the tour you know, next summer, so uh, watch out. Uh, you'll either have a new team member or a competitor, but either way, I'll get my sleep.